All right, guys, I want to make a quick video. But I've got to make this quick because I got rice cooking on the stove, so don't want it to burn or cook too long. So, uh, um, first thing, uh, family's coming back. My wife and son are coming back from Delaware tomorrow, so that should be exciting. Uh, coming back to Texas where we live, San Antonio. So, should be exciting for them to get back. Um, so, uh, yeah, should be fun. Uh, they've been gone for like two and a half weeks, something like that. So they'll be back tomorrow. Um, uh, hope they had fun up there. I think they did. So Nick Ryan had a lot of fun. I'm, I'm miss him. I'm glad he's coming back. Um, it's been quiet without him. So anyway, they'll be back tomorrow. Um, the other thing I want to talk about is, uh, uh, Bob Saget, I was a big fan of his, especially the <clears throat> '90s Bob Saget. I mean, I still like the comedy he did uh, recently, but I was really a big fan of his um, his uh, Full House, and then um, like, I even liked America's Funniest Home Videos. It's just sad because it's kind of like a lot of our childhoods are kind of dying because you know you you know I remember as a kid watching him on Friday night and then watching like Golden Girls on Saturday night. So, you know, all those people that were part of that um, are, pa are passing away. Uh, and I guess what's harder for him with his is because he was kind of so unexpected. I mean, 65 is mean, not that old, but, um, you know, Betty White, she was 99. So it's not like, you know, it's that's expected. So um, it's just sad. I mean, it's sad on both sides, but it's really sad on his side, of, you know, and I don't know, just, uh, he seemed, he seemed like he was in good health, but, you know, I guess that just means you got to live every day the best you can, because we're not guaranteed the next day, so you got to live the life you want to live, so, every day, go after your goals and get out of your comfort zone and all that stuff, so, but, um, yeah, it was sad. You know, what's funny is, I was here, I was talking to, to somebody about this today, you know, when you're um, when you're young, like when you're in your 20s, 65 seems old. When you get in your 40s, it's kind of tangible. It's kind of up there. I mean, it's, it's it's getting close. It doesn't seem that old. So it's weird how you know. I mean, I'm 44 right now. 65 doesn't seem that old. Now, that's right around the corner. I mean, not too around the corner, but close enough. It's closer to 65 is closer than 25. Or it's about the same, but you know what I mean. It's it's still it's like right right next to each other. I mean, you know, it's the same amount of time. So I could be remember being twenty five. Doesn't seem that long ago. So you know, uh, if I knew it, you know. So yeah. So I, yeah, it's sad. Um, but you know, we all it, it all happens to us all. No, nobody makes it out alive. So uh, we just gotta live the best we can. You know. Anyway, uh, hope everybody's having a good Tuesday night. Um, and uh, doing the doing everything you want to do. So, uh, anyway, I, I got to wrap this up because uh, my rice will be burning any time now. I need to get it out. Hope I hope I get a lot of views. I need subscribers. Any please subscribe to my channel, like it, view it, all the three. And have a good night, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.